Time to chain this snake. Only one of an enemy. Chain that single enemy repeatedly. I've never said speedruns are for degenerates. I don't need to hit myself because I can just do it to him hitting me. He's attacking me. Snake skin. There we go. I think speedruns are pretty entertaining to watch. I like so I like speedruns a lot as a social thing. Ever since streaming, I feel like speedruns before streaming was extremely like uh, niche. No, it it transcends niche. I feel like sp speedrunning before streaming was like borderline like antisocial. It was like so specialty. It was like like literally, what are you doing? But ever since like playing video games while speed, like ever since like having company while speedrunning, ever since like the speedrunning community came to be, it's like this is actually a really cool thing. Everyone united by their love of video games. We all love video games, right? I do. Snake skin, and I got the leather breastplate. How many snake skins am I at? Like 10? I'm at 10, I'm pretty good. 11? I was like dead sure that I had an even number. Oh. The guy who holds the record for Goldeneye said that speedruns are for degenerate people. Yo, that's his opinion. One guy doesn't speak for everyone. I feel like that kind of thing happens a lot. Where, like, let's say you have Olympic sp sprinters. I just picked a literally random group. And then one Olympic sprinter comes up and says, like, fucking... No one should become an Olympic sprinter at shit. All of a sudden, like, everyone's like, oh my god, like, even the sprinters say you shouldn't be a sprinter. It's like, shit, you're not everyone. Nice name. Alright, I have 12. My current goal is to go to Jahara. And accept a quest, and then go to the Wester Sand. We've done the vast majority of these. War Chief Spinelli. I think this guy already did a mark for him before. I forgot there were NPCs involved in multiple marks. You probably have to do that one to be able to do this one. That's not the right guy. Was he? I like already forgot. He must be deep. Oh, is this just straight up the um, 
No, it's not the Great Chief. Alright, who the fuck? Where was he? Okay, he was here. He's a... I would literally never do that. I looked at his location on the map and I still forgot it somehow. Geomancers were a pretty cool class in Final Fantasy Tactics. They had a really weird skill that would always do... It would do damage based on what you were standing on. Or the damage was like constant. But the element would be based on what you were standing on and it would randomly inflict a status element at like 1 in 4 chance. Hey. God, I... there. Literally the last place I went. Kato will pass. Okay. I can probably get a bunch of... Alright, here comes the bizarre exploitation. I have to do this super carefully because I don't know what I've done and what I haven't done. Let's first get rid of all the crap. Which isn't thankfully very much. I kind of need more arcana. I sell these. That gives me that. Cause I've, I've sold a high arcana before. So let's go back and sell these. Plus, what was it? One scarletite. One Hellgate's Flame. Where's Bazaar? Two War Gods bands. That's it. So that should give me two. Yeah, Joel the Serpent and Joel Creation. And now I should be able to sell... I don't have a soul powder. That's a problem. Where do you get soul powder? I need one more. Oh, you got one from the Ixtab hunt. He's in the Hennet Mines. I'll get one of those eventually. Alright, I can't do anything here for a little while yet. I have good loots though. I need more Serpent Eyes. And then I've almost got everything I need. I 
I can get another High Arcana right now. You only need three, and I already sold one apparently, and I got one right now, so... It's one Face Stone, one Soul of Amarasa, and ten Arcana. Life Crystal. Alright, so I'm pretty much done with my Arcanas. I got all those. I need um, three more Serpent Eyes. That's really easy. Best speedrunning video really is the one with Caveman and Chibi. Every day I wake up, I'm glad I'm not Chibi. Chibi has the fucking the worst life of any human. No, I need three Serpentarius though. No, but that's still that's still three more Serpent Eyes. I'm almost to the point where I can buy the Tornasol. And I almost have enough money for the Tornasol. What the fuck? When did that happen? Jesus. If I go to Subterra, I can actually, like, start on that. But I'm gonna go kill a few more marks first. Uh, I need to warp to the Wester Sand? No, that's not the best way. So maybe it is the best way. I think it is. I haven't warped to the Western Sand in a long time. Oh yeah! Wasn't that him? He's like going to going to speed run event, like bringing some co buying some condoms just in case. That was Chibi, wasn't it? I forgot that was him. There was like that, there was the fucking cheating on the jump, and there was the him being annoying as fuck. What a deadly combination. Chibi like ruined his own life. Going south on this map. I bet everyone at the speedrunning event was fucking not only a man, but also unfuckable. So Marlith was in here, and I already got that, so there's nothing else I can do in this map. Sleep with someone who has health. Oh wait, don't I need Hecked Eyes? These are slimes. No one has Gambits on. Damn, it must suck to be GB. Here. The enemies here are pretty tough, but not insane. Alright, I can unlock that from the other side. I don't know if I took the right entrance. This place is pretty big in a pretty mean way. Ow. You think you are unfuckable? I don't know, I'm alright. I'm not ugly anyway. There's a lot of stuff that goes... What the fuck is that? There's a lot of stuff that goes into being fuckable. Or not fuckable. I've had girlfriends. That's the real question of whether you're fuckable or not.
Going off map. I came here earlier. I didn't realize that was a, a rare game here. Oh, this is the map. This thing probably isn't that hard, but... Well, I just saved, so... No matter how bad it is, it won't be that bad. Ah, oh, that did a lot of fucking damage. Jesus. What the fuck? Why'd that do that much? Why is that doing that much? Why is this guy so strong? He doesn't even have bravery or anything. I take it all back. Jesus. That power. Not attacking super quick. Why you have most of his health? No one's died except Boss, who was immediately revived. I'm getting hella parries on him. Okay, this is for some reason going super, super well. He's just not attacking very fast. not close to him. Whale, what's that gonna do? What's that gonna do? Still doing good damage to him. Oh, that silenced. On. Blinded Balthier, who's already got a Kirizo going. Haste. Alright, you stop that right now. I think I got him, though. I don't think he can still win. Famous last words. He's got, like, no visible health. Come on, you're dead. Yeah, get out, get out, get out. That power, though! Jesus! Alright, that's technically what I'm here for. Chainmail. I think I ground that one time. Miter. Maybe it was that that I ground. That power, dude! All that damage! Like, you did like 3,000 per hit twice. I got kind of lucky. Because he, I blocked a lot of attacks. That could have been a much harder fight. Alright, so apparently if I kill these guys, there's a rare game that spawns. Alright, I just fucking healed something. Bombs have crazy resistance to, um... Uh, guns regardless. But at least water is strong against them. Alright, so there should be a... Should be a boss version? Slasher. I think I... Ah, oh, it was that that I ground. I thought, I thought that was going to be a boss version. Where are you, bastard? How do you spawn the boss version? All the grenades in the secret area were chest 16 ATR. Wait near 18, and it should spawn. Okay. Wait patiently here. Okay, I'm waiting with super speed. Okay, I see Molin. What are you? Is that the thing I'm waiting for? It is not. Wait, it doesn't even have a name. What is Molin? Can he even get over to me? He's like all the way over there. Let's make our way to Molin. Oh, here's another grenade. 
Let's go back to where we were waiting earlier. Mullen is a rare game, I'm pretty sure, because he doesn't have a subtitle in his name. Yeah, he's supposed to be across the chasm. Alright, I successfully spawned Mullen. Let's go punch him. He might be harder than the boss I just fought. A useful source of mithril. Yeah, cool. I'm gonna steal. Yeah, there he is. GG easy. Couldn't steal. Couldn't steal. Yep, I get the feeling that this guy is gonna be um. 6% 6 mithril steel and uh, no other steals. What even does mithril give you? Ultimate blade, I guess? Or something. Stop that bomb. I should probably dispel him. He doesn't seem that dangerous, even with haste. He's just not doing very much damage. 55% mithril, is that his drop? I'll get a steal first. I stole some. Iron ore, arcana. No mithril. Well, we got one. I just wanted to fight him. I'm trying to fight everything. Alright, so this map should be the map where everything goes to shit. It's probably 5%. Because, or that I am unlucky as fuck. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is the map. Note that um, things are going to shit on my little mini map there. So this is the one um, boss. This is the one Esper you can leave the map. And pretty much every Esper you can steal High Arcana from, and High Arcana is really gay to find. This one is also from FFT. This one might be a drama lag. I can live without the Gigas chest plate. It is a drama lag. Protect shell haste. This guy's a gimmick. I think it's the flies. Which means my mage team would almost certainly be a lot better against him. No, I don't care. I literally don't care. I've got a pole and a gun. Um Okay, what's my plan here? Let me check his steals really fast. Andromalic Final Fantasy XII boss. He's the Roth. Pebble Capricorn Gem Hierarchana. I already have all the Hierarchanas I need to beat the game. So it doesn't really matter if I get it. The Molem had one. Shit. Alright, I'm just gonna try and kill him. We'll see what happens. I remember he has a gravity-based gimmick, I think. Wow, he has no health. What the fuck? Alright, so the trick with this fight is I definitely don't want to be attacking lowest health. I want to be attacking, like, highest max HP. I never actually got. Alright, he has like no HP. He's like the first one you can really encounter. So it wouldn't be surprising at all at all of you, it's pretty easy. Dundaja. Okay, so he's got a jaw spell. It's probably an animation one. Here we go. Let's see how strong it is. The animation versions are weaker than the actual versions. That still did quite a lot. It inflicted stop. That's annoying. The characters I care about not have being stopped. Oh, he's got a paling. Okay. 
Um, I really, 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 really need to not be stopped on Balthier right now. So I can get some healing off. Slow plus sleep. That's shit. Okay, I woke up immediately. Alright, the paling makes things a little bit more annoying. This is still, like, looking really good. Platinum dagger. Oh, yes. Paling already wore off. Slow plus gun makes you attack so slowly. Come on. Red is just chilling there. Wake up, you dumb fuck. There we go. No, he's still asleep. Don't dare punch that man. Alright, Redis is awake again. Oh, he missed him. Because I'm blinded. Alright. Let's just have Vaughn. Vaughn's doing nothing. Let's get, let him get his attack off. And then we'll let him use a... Uh, alarm clock. Oh, I fell asleep while using an alarm clock. Why are these enemies not fucking waking me up? Just hit me. I'm content to wait this out rather than to equip the items that make you... Oh, we're awake. Oh, he has... these guys have more health than he does. So we're attacking the wrong enemy. That was a pretty easy boss. Just all pebble from him too. If I had the anti-gambits for sleep and stop, or not the anti-gambits, well yeah the anti-gambits, but also the anti-gear, then it would have been a joke. It would have been really hard. That The thing about flying enemies is the game assumes that you have a really hard time attacking flying enemies. And fortunately for this playthrough I just don't. It probably would have been even faster if I was casting magic on him. Flying enemies are often weak to wind. Dromalek, they're off. <sighs> oh, look, these guys are still here. You actually need like all 12 gambit slots on every character in uh, the base game. The map's still fucked. Let's say necklace. Is that an equip? Probably not. It's probably a loot. Anyway, um, we got a new license. Drama like gives machinist absolutely nothing. Gives white mage the soul eater and battle lore. That's like a joke. Gives Red Mage absolutely nothing. Alon gets Battle Lore, that's really good. Gives Ash absolutely nothing. Gives Pinello, the Fumarole, and the Tumulus. Fumarole's a pretty low level handbomb, I guess. Alright. Nothing. No, 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 not 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 Balthier. Bosch gets it. What's Mithra will do? Isn't it like one of the great swords? I should maybe just go get another one. Flying breath is annoying. don't need that. Whale Whisker is a high level pole, right? I can live without that. So 
So I've technically got everything I need down here. I can go see the Archeo Avis, but they're just gonna fuck me up. Like, they will fuck me up. They spawn at random levels, and those levels are really high. The lowest level they can spawn is like 60, which is still way too high. And there's usually several of them. Is that them? Is that one? What are you? No. What are you? This is a named enemy. He's got haste and brave. I'd really prefer not to fight him like that. What the fuck is Belt here? And he spotted me. Alright, no more brave. What are you? Doesn't have that much health, doesn't have that much attack. I should be alright. Bell trophy. Cool. The enemies to teleport are so annoying. That's a uh, toys of some variety. Silicone, silicon tortoise. Yes. These turtle shells are really nice. Yes. I hate enemies that teleport. That fat invincibility for, like, no reason. I've entered this dungeon through this map so many times. I'd like to make it so I never have to enter here again. What the fuck? More what? Nice, we've got a location we've never come up before. Oh wait, I might be... No, maybe not. I hear rain noises, where the fuck am I? Oh, I'm in I'm in Osmo and Plains. Yeah, I've had a lot of opportunities to come to where I am right now. Journey and Caverns actually stretches across like the whole south portion of the game. And by the whole south portion I basically mean the Western Sand and Giza and not Giza. Um, I don't care at all about any of this. There's Thieves Cuffs here. I could get those. I wouldn't mind a second pair of Thieves Cuffs. Okay, I'm gonna get that. Oh. I guess I'll get the last Mithril too. I already have another one. I won't really be going out of my way to get this stuff. I hate these damn things. I prefer not to fight these guys. This map is still annoying even when you kill the boss. How many espers do I have now? Like four? I got the three storyline ones, and I've got two optional ones, I think. Three optional ones. Do I really have six espers? Jesus. This place have baby monster, but if you go deeper it becomes hell. You're probably thinking about the Archaeo Avis. Which is like the one scary enemy in this whole place. Not cutting the boss I just killed. The two bosses I just killed. So in this spot right here, there's a 25% chance of a chest that has um, these cuffs in it.
Grenade! Purple ring stolen? Jesus Christ, that's pretty good. Alright, where are you, you bastard? Spawn for me. There he is. I was about to wonder aloud whether he was one of a kind. Nope. It actually would be really fun to try and get one of every item. This guy's made of mithril, huh? Game patiently waited for that to resolve. This guy's almost cute. Trying to kick me. Gotta be five percent. Okay, I stole it. Cause that shit is too uncommon. That's a good mistake. Iron ore. All right, let's grind that um, thief cuff. I might have gotten no. I got my initial thief cuff and must for in high waste, which is the earliest. I can go back there and get. Um, there's a prize there now. A prize, real elaborate. There's a esper there. I could go I could go to Moss Four and High Waste and grab an Esper. It's actually my favorite Esper in the game, because it's my favorite villain in the game. So far we've only run into the FFT Espers. But they had to create some Espers because there weren't actually thirteen. Not every single Zodiac Stone in FFT had a Esper associated with it. Most of them did. But there were like four that didn't, and they had to invent those four. Stop being sapped. And the, the guys they created are perfect. In general, the Esper designs in this game are like 10 out of 10. Monster designs in this game are 10 out of 10. I want Thief's Cuffs. I want Thief's Cuffs. It would be faster if I just punched myself in the face and then ran, entered the room. That's usually how things go, isn't it? Most of the things in this world are faster if you punch yourself in the face. Every time you map transition, um, RNG gets flipped all over. Aha! First try. After save staying. That means I didn't have to state load. So I'm gonna save now because I could run into an RKO Avis and that would suck. Or I'm gonna try and run into Arco Avis, and it is gonna suck. There's no wood about it. I'm gonna try and pull only one, and I'm gonna cross my fingers that it's a low-level one. And I'm gonna try and steal from it, but I don't even know if it steals are good. 
but there's a good chance one of these things can just fuck me. The highest level, they're the highest level random enemies in the game. They're actually higher level than everything else in the game, like literally everything else. So I want to go to that left map and then go north. I can explore close to this whole place now. There's probably a chest in here somewhere. I like the sandstorm, it's kind of cool looking. I'd rather go north. Is that him? Yup, that's them. Archeo Avis. These guys are the real deal. I would really, 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 really like someone equipping a bangle. This one is level 84. See, um, that's over double my level. It's actually slightly under double my level. Let's look up Archeo Avis and see what we can do to them, if anything. Steal from them. Emperor Scales, needed for the Durandal. It's actually the Durandal A. And it's also the fucking Aldebaran Y. Of course, dude. Of fucking course. I'm not okay with this. So, what's the odds of him dropping his fucking rare? 14% with the Dragoon monograph, which I'm not even sure if I have. What's the one I don't have? Okay, I have Dragoon. The one I don't have is Sages. So, I have an incredibly low chance if I even manage to kill one of these things, which I won't. I have an incredibly low chance of getting... What's the other one? What level are you? 84 and 61. Okay, I could maybe kill the 61. Oh, look at all these status ailments they're dropping on me. Where are you? Thought he was dead. Alright, 36. You're like a joke. Alright, I've done absolutely nothing to this one. And I have only tickled the other one. And it looks like very, very difficult to pull one and not the other. Is that weak to holy or weak to water? I can't tell the difference. What's the strat to killing these guys? It's probably it's probably the Nihapala OI plus fucking remedy. That's what it always is. Yeah, I'll come back here someday in the far future. Best not to fuck around with these things right now. Or ever. What the fuck? Turn the camera around on me. I'm gonna need like ribbons to fight these things.
That. I need that thing. This thing has a drop I care about. Battleworm Carapace. That might be it. I don't remember. I need to find more of those guys. I need the map from this place. I want all rare monsters. Open the goddamn chest! Jesus! Okay. There's another one. I think it didn't give me whatever I wanted. Kinda spooky. It's a bogey, I need one of these guys too. Sky Jewel. I think that's the Sky Jewel I needed. over here. Yep. Fucking Chris Chris Redfield right here. Oh am I loosen my shirt? It's hot in this room. Alright, we've pretty much hit this whole area. I want the map, which appears to be in the room with the Archaeo Abysses. bad because it means I need to run past them. Alright, we got a place to surface. This might be that place. There might be another mark right here. Nope. I'm looking for... Where? It's the Namienta. I'm looking for this place. It's probably still in Zernin. Alright, because I like map transitioned away like to an entirely different region, I think the enemies are gonna respawn, which is good because I need to kill more of that ghosty and also more of that skeleton. How did I get to this map? Okay, from the west. Both the ghosty and the skeleton should be in here. I think I needed two of those, but I don't remember why. I think it was something good. Chain link belt, the bubble belt. Yup, 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 yup. Ah, but the, ah, but the ultimate blade. Who the fuck has death powder?
bogey. That's right. Oh, it's this dude. It's the ghost. The one I literally just found. 16% drop for death powder. That's the one place you can get it. I need two. I had to kill two of that guy. He's in this map, he might be elsewhere. We're about to get some good items. Okay, that ghost seems pretty rare. Ah, oh, Vaughn, healing it. Okay, that ghost seems super rare. Where the fuck can I find more than one of him? really like to somehow I'll grind it. <gasps> divide. Yes, divide. Death powder, I got one. Did he actually succeed in dividing or not? I might have had one of my allies just kill him in some random location. I right, got one death powder though. I need two. Jesus, I'm gonna become a god once I get this. What's wrong, Guile? You came here expecting to find a madman, but instead you found a god? I'm making a Tarnasol eventually. I'm not making one right now. Of course, the Eldvar and Y requires. Ghosts, please. Oh. Of course, the Elder Baron Y requires the fucking Battle Worm Carapace. Oh shit, I'm in this map. <laughs> Alright, let's just go while his attention is on that dude. Never mind. What is this? Oh shit. Your map for this area is complete. I need to get the fuck out of here. I need to get the fuck out of here. At the end of all of it, I'm glad disease was the worst thing. Alright. What are the items you can find in the map with the, um... Okay, wait, this is the big question. I think I got every rare game, every mark. The only thing I didn't get is the Archaeoavis. Pretty good success. Every chest. Literally nothing interesting. Sight unseeing would be nice. I might already have that. Alright, so we got Marlith, which we got. We got K K Tobal Pass. We got that melon guy. I forget his name. We got Al Teki Tessie. We got the Esper. We got the map. I would say we've pretty much cleared this place out. So we just need a soul powder. And then we're done here. Alright, 
60% of the single enemy who can apparently spawn them. Where are you? There you are. Sky Jewel. Nope. Not it. Nothing. 16%. That's double 8%. Death Powder. Got it. Stop that. Stop. Okay. Let's take a look at our map. Can't go there. Maybe someday. Looks like as long as we just follow out here. I think the Tornasol, once you make it, you're done making it. Like, I think that some a lot of bizarre items you can only get once. There's actually very few that you can get multiple times. Most of the bizarre drops are one of a kind. Oh, I should kill these guys. You have to kill one of everything in order to complete the um, Sky Pirate's Den. Alright, so it should be that if I go here, that's the spot I want to go to right now. Feels good to touch a save stone after all that. Alright, so we go north, east, and then nor northwest, and then northeast. I guess. Place. This is before I became broken. So this should be the final entrance to the Zertan Caverns, if I'm not fully mistaken. Looking promising. find a chest for sight unseeing here, but I think I already have it, so it, there's a good chance that chest is, isn't going to exist. You are Matt Hardy? Huh? Explain. 
Never mind, I never had sight on seeing. That might be the only place in the game to get it. So now, here's another way in, slash way out. Oh, I don't care about that, I wanna go north. So the mark that's in this map that I'm about to go to right now. I actually want to read it off because it's pretty interesting. The way they pull this off on you. I was amused. This mark. This one is... Belito. Creature called Belito. Said to be creating sandstorms with its wings in the Namiensa Sand Sea. Information is sparse and Mont Blanc wants you to investigate further. I think I'm in the map. Need to verify. Yep. This is the place where Belito is. Belito is my second favorite mark after, um... After Gilgamesh. <laughs> so we've drawn you out at last! A moth cannot resist the flame. Now you will burn. Long time no see, Bazir. I've been biding my time trolling for hunters. So long you've kept me waiting. I was beginning to think you didn't care. You are looking rather careworn. Are the lizards in the sand pits not company enough for you? My blade requires a sharper tongue to keep its edge. Oh shit, here they are. Bagamnin, Boggy, and that's it. I have a teammate. Moaned. So here's fucking Bagamnin, and he's got the saw again. Um, I don't remember if this fight is hard, but I definitely think that I would be a lot better off. Whoa, I stole an elixir from him. Okay, here we go. This is two fucking other ones. Gijuk and Renok. If I had fucking dispel, dispel ga or whatever. Wait, I might actually have that. Yeah, I do. <laughs> All right, this is gonna make this fight a lot easier. So now everyone lost all of their buffs. I don't know about the. Air. Is this the girl one? Renok. She's making girl noises. I think it's female. Game then was the mark. Straight to his death. Eaten by Yenses, what a way to go. Do I have my custom emote yet? Reload the page. That's a fun little mark. The game then was my mark. Not custom emote yet. I submitted one, but it hasn't been approved yet. Ding ding. He was the hunter stalker. He was trying to lure us. Belito hunt was all for show.
<laughs> Mega elixir. Well, that's nice. I think there's a rare item here. There. There's fucking nothing here. So where am I? The Ogre Yenser Sansi? No, I'm in the Name Yenser. Mm, nope. Am I not? How do I get to this map? There we go. It's supposed to be a turtle shell choker here. Did I pick it up during the fight? Or am I dumb? Could be both. Maybe it's not here during the initial fight. So badly I wish this game had warp wings or a warp spell or something like that. I get they tried to make the world seem really huge. by removing your ability to teleport around. That's a cheap way to do it. Bent staff. Here we go. Turtle shell choker. Is that it? Is that everything? Yes. A rare game. Okay, I want him. I want to kill that thing. Glad I looked. Kill all the enemies in the immediate area and wait patiently in the far circle. Aha! There he is. I'm too good! Alright, I'm gonna dispel that. Do I care? He's only got shell. I can live with shell. Damn, he died in like two hits. Every enemy like that, I'm just like, what is your trick? What cool thing do you have? Uh, I found enough bed staffs and I'm now pretty sure it's not a weapon but a loot. Oh, I didn't answer that question, but um, if you kill them the first time, they don't actually die. If you fight them earlier. So what's my fastest way to a teleport stone? That's not that fast. That's pretty slow. That's also really s that's slower. That's pretty slow. Looks like it's that one. And then straight to the east again. Getting weapons out and putting weapons away shouldn't have been a fucking mechanic. My bedroom is hot, I gotta open a window and get some more liquid. Kidney stones and shit. Alright, give me 10 seconds. This should be a safe map.
Here I am. Ugh. Anyway. Damn, keep this on the DL, but my birthday's in like 23 days. I'm gonna be old. I'm gonna be well on a third into my life. Not too bad when you consider I can't remember most of the like the first like half of it. Maybe not the first half. So I've got Gilgamesh. Go to that place. Jahara. Could have just given me the reward right there. You guys want a story of when I was younger and more, um. I guess cute? A story of a different bath from a different time. When I was a kid, we would go on vacation all the time because my parents are, um. uh. immigrants. Im immigrants from England. Um, and I didn't like vacationing, and I still don't like vacationing, which is why I never leave my house. Like, this is actually, like, this is a huge part of, like, who I am. Actually, the guy was over here, wasn't he? I do not like traveling. I was forced to travel a lot as a kid. And ever since then, I just hate it. I hate traveling. Anyway, uh, I would spend about one month a year at Volcano. That's a super good hand bomb. I'd spend about one month a year in England. And I did not like it. And I would like dread when the England trip was coming because we went every like, it, we went like every two years actually, so it was one month every two years. But I would dread when the England trip was coming. Like I didn't want to ever go. What do I do right now? Anyway, I would like look forward when I was on the England trip to like fucking go home. Like the whole time I was like, I can't wait to go home. And one time, like, I, we were gone for like a month. But before we left, I got like two orders of breadsticks at uh, Pizza Hut. And I really liked Pizza Hut breadsticks at the time for whatever reason. I was like probably eight. And um, they were in the freezer or something. They weren't in the fridge. We like actually froze them because we were going to be gone for a long time. And I was like, um, I was like really excited to like finally be able to go home so I could eat those like breadsticks, even though like you could probably get breadsticks or like, you know, better food in England at any point. I just wanted, I wanted the comfort of my house, but I didn't know how to, I didn't realize back then that I just wanted the comfort of my house, but I was like so excited over something so stupid. You know how kids are. Balfenheim. Bujerba. I could probably kill Ultima at this point. Maybe. Anyway, when we finally got home, I was looking forward to, to it for like a month, and when we finally got home, I went to the freezer, and I got out the breadsticks, and I put them in the microwave, and I put them on high for three minutes. And I super badly burned them. And they were inedible. They got like all tough, and like, like you know, burned. And it like, that thing I'd been looking forward to for so long, I like couldn't enjoy. And for some reason that like destroyed me. I guess I could hear it. Why not, right? Where are we? Where are we?
sorry, I was eating breadsticks. That's why I thought of the story. I went to, um... Um... What do you call that place? Chuck E. Cheese's. Yesterday. Chuck E. Cheese's is the happiest place to go when you're a kid and the saddest place to go when you're an adult. It's honestly pathetic. Chuck E. Cheese is a pathetic place. Like, everything everything good you felt about this that place is reversed once you go there as an adult. Anyway, I remember really liking the breadsticks there, so I got them. And, um, they were good. They were really good. I'm actually not eating the breadsticks right now. I'm eating the cheesy sticks, because I couldn't remember which was the one I had as a kid. It was the breadsticks, as it turns out. Cheesy sticks were like a new thing. Anyway. I got the, um... Uh, while I was in there. Now, what was the point of the story? Maybe the point of the story was that I went to Chuck E. Cheese's. Oh yeah, there was also the um, animatronic. They only had the uh, Chuck E. They didn't have any of the other ones. Which I was a little disappointed by. Not extraordinarily, though. And, um, I gotta say, that thing is really scary. As a kid, I was really afraid of animatronics. I gotta say, they're still not, like, you know... They're still not normal. I'm not afraid of them, but, like, shit. Got an alarm clock. That was good. I want to check out Galmore Jungle. I'm, try I'm at the point where I'm trying to hunt, um, like every enemy. I want to be able to cross off areas and never have to go there again. So the map was, like, fucking right in the beginning area. Let's go over there. That's to the west. I haven't had the map in this area the whole time I've played this game. This is like the fucking the place that the map has eluded me the longest. It's time to finally get it. This might be the only region I don't have the map for. The 30 regions I've visited. Kids latch onto such weird ideas. I remember one time I was in England, like, we didn't have access to the internet. And I remember being really bothered by that, but like, I didn't even use the internet yet. You know what I mean? Like, I didn't even do anything on the internet. The only, th only thing I ever did on the internet was like, go on forums and like, like, like chat with friends. I, w I didn't even discover like guy online or anything like that. Not that I'm defending guy online, but way back, way, way back in the early days of the internet, that was what I did. Um. But I remember one time when we were in England, I was like, I desperately wanted a computer, and the reason I wanted to be able to use the internet was to. What is this? To go on, there was like a website called Rubber Faces that I like saw on the news. It was like fucking, it was just a website that had very early, like, editing. Yeah, face tones are valuable. You can get them like in a lot of different places too. They're useful because you can use them to make Hyrakana too. So now we've completed the map of this area. Gonna take a quick look around. Can spawn in many places. 20% chance of spawning. Bullshit. Just gotta re enter this area repeatedly. At least these enemies are easy. Anyway, there was this website that was like, it would just let you, it would give you pictures of celebrities or whatever, and you could just like take their parts of their faces and just stretch them around. That was all the website was. And I think it became, like, it It showed up on the news, and then it was free, and it became, like, pay to use. Like, after it showed up on the news. I guess it got a lot of fucking, you know. It was, like, the kind of stuff that would only be famous on really early internet. It's like, wow, look, you can use fucking photo editing software on this website.
Anyway, the point of the story is that um, for whatever reason, I just decided I really wanted to go on over faces, and I like made my parents. I didn't make them, but like they paid to use like an internet kiosk in England just so I could go on that website. And like looking back, it's like why on earth? Why did I care so much? Why was that worth money? Feels foreign now. Still not as foreign as when I kind of picked these up with Ryu. It's like I was playing a completely different game. In what universe is my Ryu even close to as good as my Laura? Okay, I can't find this rare game. 20% chance of spawning. The only thing in this world better than food is drink. Why did that hellhound have an alarm clock? Just idly wondering. I found him. That was fast. This guy only spawns half the time. And by half the time I mean every 30 minutes. How oh, is there like a trophy game on like, or like a rare enemy on like every single map? This guy's pretty tough. I was one over here. I can make that trek. Bit annoying though.
An NPC. Is that bunny wearing leggings? Is that bunny wearing leggings? Oh man. Look at that armor. Bunny leggings. I could have just teleported here. Forgot this is a teleport location. Alright, so I clear out all the Marlboros. And it's a 1 in 5 that this monster spawns. You die. Not even high quality lumber, just regular ass lumber. Where the hell does this go? Bottom path. Forgot there were two. I don't think I've ever gone that way. Black belt. That's probably guaranteed. This bastard didn't spawn. I kill the Trent and see if it helps. Every enemy, for the most part, should stay dead. If you can Philo. That's the one I was looking for. I killed him in one hit. He didn't spawn where he's supposed to spawn. He spawned in like a radically different place. But I got him. So where did that mark want me to go? I'm doing so much stuff now. Great village. In the Feywood. So now I'm trying to go south. God, if I kill a single Cerberus and get a single Hellgate's Flame, I'm gonna flip a bitch. I think I can clear out most of the Feywood. Having flashbacks to that one um, bunny I killed here. Absolutely nothing interesting at all. A rare game, Crypt Bunny. I already killed that one. I got the Crypt Bunny. Dreadguard. I got that one. 
but I didn't get his trophy? Or did I? Did I already accepted trophies? Was trophy games already something I was doing? I think I'd like freshly done it. Yeah. I think that was like the first one I got. Oh, Thier punch me. Nice. So these top three maps, there's literally nothing I care about. Antiquity's End. And the Wild Mall Rose directly below the save point. That's convenient. Embroider Tippet. That's that's a 25% chance spawn chest. That's an item worth having. Bubble Belt, Bubble Belt, Thief's Cuff, and a team like this is like the, what I've been waiting for. My whole playthrough. Spent a pretty good amount of time on this map now. So on the north one. So directly beneath me is going to be the Wild Marlboro, which is not as bad as Carrot, I think. But we'll see. We're just going to go in and fight it and see what happens. Ooh, there's a bunch of them. I feel like my mage team would have a lot more fun here. Four Marlboros. One of them is the boss version. Alright, that did a lot of damage. This is doing a lot of damage. Also, that did a lot of damage. Alright, this guy's got... He's got Protect. I'd like to get rid of that ASAP. I also need to hear it. That's more important. Jesus, he's strong. Why is every enemy so dangerous at this stage in the game? What do you have? Why are you doing so much? Okay, he's got bravery, that's why. I should have dispelled immediately. He's also hasted. Alright, well, sub team. Mage team does what mage team does, kill multiple enemies and then die. He's no longer hasted. He's no longer got bravery. His damage is just gonna go to shit. Always start with the spell, that's our lesson here. Did he really just full heal? Got his wake up. I can't believe I haven't made a... Whoa. Not the real deal. A paling. I could have won this ages ago. Stop biting me. This paling, though. I do that? Oh, because it's Vaughn who just died. Boss isn't even dead, he's just stoned. Did I just game over? I think I just saved. I forgot. I forgot that I had two dead teams.
Here we go. That's fine. Believe. I want the three 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 two 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 one one one. Twelve. I got a three three one one one. I need another three and I need I must endure. I got another one. I need three twos. Um, that was the run. So I need two dudes now. That's fine. Can't get anything else. Waters are luck based. I'm using save states to mitigate the luck. That was the longest I could have made it. My ending is Inferno. Oh, you dead, Marlboro. If you live through that, I'm surprised. 21,000. Okay, can you just not kill him in. Ah, oh, motherfucker. Can you just not kill him the first cycle, or did I get really close and then fail? What I could have done, which is what I probably should have done. Oh, Redis is... Oh, he's everything. KO disease oil. Okay, he's helpful. Get him to use a vaccine on himself. When can I buy vaccines? This fight is just like randomly really hard. Often is the way with status effect bosses. Wine salt and poison. I think that basically gives you just random status ailments. I swear to god, you motherfucker, if you put up a failing right now. Huh. If Fran wasn't... Kill... If not for Pinello... I could have a fun time right now. This is FF12, yes. Well, I was unfortunately being targeted by Balthier. The Paling. Whenever I can, like, outrun him. I doubt it, he moves really quick. Not a strat with long term goal. His combo rate goes so high. Ah, Phoenix down. Use 
lose. At least he hit himself. Where the fuck are my Phoenix Downs? Why my items have no fucking rhyme or reason to them? Damn it. Phoenix Downs, someone getting raised. I want a Phoenix down, and then I want to. I want to cast Kiraja. And I'm really hoping that first hit isn't the beginning of a long combo. This guy's so bullshit! Leave me alone! His damage isn't that high, he's just attacking annoying characters. Please give me a Kiraja. Damn it, please. Let me get off a heal. Why is this paling last an hour? God damn it. He was about to heal himself. Or he was he was he'd already healed. He's just heal takes time. Jesus Christ, there we go. You die today, motherfucker. I want the Alright, I if I did like three. I just got a 3 and a 2, that's decent. I do have Shades of Black. Does that pierce palings? Or something? Three, two, three. All from Bomb. I need another 3. Hopefully from Vaughn. That was it. Alright, I could have done that. Yep. Alright, I got all my threes. I have one, two. Actually, really like another three. I already have no time. Can I even do that? Is that possible? No, you can't. I don't have I need to roll the mischarge. It's the only way. I don't think I want this three. I'll see if I roll a mischarge on the next one. Here she comes! Alright, that's four threes and a two. Or two twos. I need two more twos and four more ones. That's gonna be like impossible. And I had to I had to take that. I like deliberately didn't, but I had to. No, I don't. I can I can maybe mash. Can I do that? Is that possible? Can I like possibly mash hard enough? Uh, it might not just shuffle fast enough. Oh, I got it. I hit the wrong one though. I want the triangle. But there is time. <laughs> Look at me. This is like the last. I need to know what Red Spiral is. Is it a 2? It's not a 3. This is hard. I need like basically frame perfect timing twice. Can I hold shuffle? 
Wait, I can. Can you hold the triangle? How did I get it once? How did I get it once? I wish I hadn't gotten it so I wouldn't be still trying. You need to get in order to in order to finish the uh, clan what's it? You need to get all possible finishers. I'm shooting right now for the hardest one. One button. This is like frame perfect. I think if you hold it, it keeps shuffling. Also, I think if you hit hold the button for shuffle, I think it doesn't shuffle as fast as if you tap the button for shuffle. Judging from what I'm feeling. Not even close. Red spiral, please. I got it with X. Just give it to me with triangle. That was so it. Don't bullshit me. I got it. I don't even know if this is going to be enough, though. I need, um... Four ones? I need a mischarge. I'm gonna have like an impossible time getting a mischarge. How about some of this? Yeah, I actually think I can't get a mischarge. I think I got the three 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 one. No, because I only got two. I didn't get enough twos.